Hello my dear friends, I am Sujoy and in this video I will tell you how to find out numerical solution of first order differential equations by Adams Bashworth predictor character formula explained in very easy language. I have two other videos on two similar methods to solve this type of problem. One is on Euler method, another is on Milnes predictor character formula. The link to those videos is given in the video description below. So for now let's start. Our question is given dy by dx equals to half into x plus y where y of 0 equals to 2, y of 0.5 equals to 2.636, y of 1.0 equals to 3.595 and y of 1.5 equals to 4.968. We have to find out what is the value for y of 2 by Adams Westford method. So let's proceed to the solution. Adam's best foot predictor formula is given below. Y n plus 1 comma p equals to Y n plus h divided by 24 into 55 y dash n minus 59 y dash n minus 1 plus 37 y dash n minus 2 minus 9 y dash n minus 3. So by putting n equals to 3 we will get this simplified formula. Here n equals to 3 because because other than the first value we have three other values of y first value second value and third value so n equals to 3 so by putting n equals to 3 we will get y n plus 1 that is 3 plus 1 4 so y 4 p equals to y n that is y 3 plus h divided by 24 into 55 y dash n that is y dash 3 minus 55 minus 59 y dash n minus 1 that is 3 minus 1 2 plus 37 y dash n minus 2 that is 3 minus 1 so 37 y dash 1 minus 9 into y dash n minus 3 that is y dash 0. Next we have given that x0 equals to 0 and y0 equals to 2 y of 0 equals to 2. Here the value inside the bracket represents the x0 value and the value at the right hand side represents the y0 value. For next term it will be x1 value y1 value. Similarly x2 value y2 value x3 value and y3 value and so on. Remember in some questions only the first value may be given. The remaining three values you may have to find it out by Taylor series method and then we can proceed to the normal solution as usual. In our case all the four values are given. x1 is 0.5, y1 is 2.636, x2 is 1.0, y2 is 3.595, x3 is 1.5 and y3 is 4.968 and given differential equation is y dash equals to half into x plus y where dy by dx is written in short as y dash and y double dash means d square y by dx that is double differentiation. So from the above equation we will find out y dash 0, y dash 1, y dash 2, y dash 3 to apply in the formula. So y dash 0 can be calculated by using x0 and y0 value. Remember 0 and 0 equals to x0 is 0, y0 is 2. So it will become 1. For y dash 1 we will use x1 and y1 values. So x1 is 0.5, y1 is 2.636. So that will become 1.568. Similarly by putting x2, y2 we will get y dash 2 value and x3, y3 we will get y dash 3 value. Now by putting the obtained values in formula number 2 that is the predictor formula we will get this is the formula and now we will put the values y3 is this plus h divided by 24 h is 0 0.5 which is obtained by h is the increment between each term of x from x0 0 next value is 0.5 increment of 0.5 
Next, by increment of 0.5, you will get 1.0. Plus 0.5, you will get 1.5. So, h is the increment in x value. So, 55 into y dash 3, this value. 59 into y dash 2, this value. Plus 37 into y dash 1, this value. Minus 9 into y dash 0, that is 1. So, by calculating this, you will get the value 6.8707. So, the predicted value is 6.8707. Now, we will correct it by the corrector formula to get the final or the accurate value. So, Adam Blasford corrector formula is given below. This is the formula. Now, by putting n equals to 3, we will get this simplified formula, which we will use to calculation. Now you can see this y dash 4 value we don't have right now. We will calculate by using x4 value and y4 value. x4 value is the value which is given in the question that is 2 and y4 value which you obtain by the predictor formula. So this 2 value is for which we have to find out the y. So 2 plus 6.8707 is equals to 4.4353. Now, by putting the required values in formula number 4, we will get this. Just put the required values in this formula and you will get the value 6.873, which is our required answer. So, y of 2 equals to 6.873. So friends, this was my video on Adam Bedford method. You can watch my previous two videos on Euler's method and Milner's predictor corrector method. The link is given in the video description below. And don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel so that when I upload my next video, you will get an email if you subscribe. And if this video has helped you, please help me by liking the video and sharing the video. Because remember, sharing is caring. So thanks for watching, see you in my next video and still then stay connected by subscribing.